I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. Hi everyone, welcome back or welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Emma and welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. If you don't know, I will be posting for Vlogmas every other day from now until Christmas. So for today's Vlogmas video, I have a bit of a collective winter haul for you guys. I will be showing you really just a lot of stuff from clothing to makeup, skincare. I have some candles. I have two pairs of boots. So just a lot of random stuff that I've collected over the past month or so from a couple different stores. I know I post a lot of hauls but they're truly one of my favorite videos to film because I just always found myself buying the most random of things. So this haul is mostly focused on like cozy winter items. Like I said I have some candles, sweaters, some new makeup, just a hodgepodge of some cozy winter things that I picked up throughout the past month that I really wanted to show you guys today and I hope you guys enjoy today's haul. So the first thing I have to show you is actually a pair of socks. These are the coziest socks ever. I love big fuzzy cozy like butter socks i think they're called you guys know of the barefoot dreams blankets they actually make socks and some other like cozy stuff i think they have like a robe some other just like cozy loungewear so i actually picked up these socks from barefoot dreams they're a really pretty like oatmeal tan pair and they are truly just the most buttery warmest fuzziest socks and i absolutely love them they had a couple different like patterns of these but i just picked up this nice like clean white tan sort of pair and they're so comfortable i love them so much i actually picked up two pairs of boots from just fab i still have a just fab subscription from probably like 2015 when every single youtuber and their mother talked about just fab i usually skip the months but i had a couple of credits from months that i've skipped so i decided to actually just pick up two new pairs of of boots for the fall and winter time first pair i got are these short little ankle booties and they're really cute because they're kind of this color block style where they have this lighter tan suede piece they have this darker chocolate then this like really pretty camel brown and they are just the same on the other side with the zipper it's a nice chunky kind of lower ankle booty so i really like this style like i said i do have a just fab subscription so i just decided to treat myself to two new pairs of boots for the fall and winter time the next pair of boots that I got are thigh high boots but they don't have a heel these are like a true chocolate brown color the heel is definitely not high at all it's very comfortable to walk in I have a couple pairs of thigh high boots already I have a black a tan and a gray pair and they all have a heel on them so I just decided to get like a normal like walking pair that I could just wear in a more casual way so they do have a zipper and then they do have some ties at the tops and I really like this color and they would obviously again and go with the outfit that I'm wearing today. So I just decided to pick up two new pairs of brown boots because like I said, I have like black and gray. I actually didn't own any brown boots before these. So these were a great addition to my shoe collection. And I really like these both. They're like suede and nice. Next, I have two candles. They're both from the brand Voluspa. I think that's how you pronounce it. Voluspa, Voluspa. I'm not really sure, honestly. But I got this one from Anthropology. This is the French Cadet and Lavender Candle. This one's very clean and fresh with a little bit of citrus in it and I really like the scent of lavender I just feel like it's really calming and nice for nighttime it's perfect for when like you just cleaned your room and it's just like a really bright fresh scent so I really like this one this is the 3.2 ounce candle from Volu Spa, so it's a little bit of a smaller size. I don't even think this is the smallest size they have, the 3.2 ounce. I think they have like tea candles that they'll give out as like samples. Like I think I've gotten one from Sephora that was like a tea candle, but this one is probably just like their original small size. I also got this big Volu Spa candle. This one is the 18 ounce. I believe this is one of their like medium sizes because I know they make like huge ones. I tried to find this one at Anthropology for months during the fall season because this is actually the spiced pumpkin latte so it's actually like one of their fall scented candles but I couldn't find it it was always sold out on the website always sold out on voluspa.com like their actual website and so I actually just found this at some random little boutique actually the same boutique that I found the barefoot dream socks it smells amazing I love voluspa candles and again this is the 32 ounce candle so you can see it's very substantial it's kind of like a Yankee candle type size so again beautiful beautiful packaging great smelling candle very good quality it burns for a long time and this one was $32 so kind of more on the expensive side but definitely worth it so next I have some clothing items from Target the first thing I got was this flannel from the brand Goodfellow which is their men's section line 
So it's just this black and white flannel. I just got it in a size small. I love a good new flannel for the winter time. I honestly wear these quite a lot. I'll wear them to bed, just lounging. I really like men's flannels, getting them in the actual men's section. I just think they're more baggy and comfortable. And I did get this in a size small, but it is, you know, for a man. So it definitely is a bit oversized on me. But I really do love this. They have this flannel in a bunch of different colors, but I actually don't own a black and white one for some reason. So that's just the one that I went for. I have a green one and like a red plaid one, but I don't have a black one. So I decided to get this. Okay, next I got this sweater from Target. It's from the brand Knox Rose. It's a really cute oversized cream sweater. It has kind of like a high low and then some slits on the side. It has a little v-neck and then it just has this like popped feature on it, which is really cool. It's really soft, just something I haven't seen before. I realized I don't have any white sweaters like this. I have a white cardigan and white turtlenecks, but I don't just have like a long sleeve like sweater shirt thing so I just decided to get this one it's very soft and cozy and I really do like this material it's just different I also got this sweater from a new day that's probably my favorite brand from Target I got it in a size extra small and it's this really beautiful like fuchsia berry knitted sweater very cozy it has these like balloon sleeves and it's just a bit oversized even though I did get it in an extra small but I just love sweaters like this just wearing it with like leggings just really cozy and cute you can also dress it up and like wear it to work or something with some slacks so I really like this color I don't really have anything in this like fuchsia berry color either so this was perfect next I got this sweat set from Target I love their sweat sets these are also from the brand a new day and this is a beautiful like copper burnt orange like rust color so it just comes with a pair of joggers and then I just got the crew neck to go with it usually with their sweat sets they have a pair of joggers and then they'll have either a crew neck or a matching sweatshirt so I just decided to go for the crew neck for this one I just love these sweat sets they have this really nice like fleece inside they're very soft very cozy and honestly the more you wash these, the softer they get. I just love these sets. I think they're so cozy and very cute. Like I really like matching sets because even though I'm just wearing like a sweatshirt and some joggers, it just looks very put together and effortless because it matches. And I really love this like rusty burnt orange color. I think it's really cute for fall and winter. So love these sets from Target. Like I said, I have like 10 of them in multiple different colors. So one last piece from Target. I just ended up getting this cardigan. It's a really pretty like terracotta color. I would say it has big pockets at the bottom and it's just a really nice cardigan it's very very soft this is also from a new day and even though I have a lot of like brown and orange I don't have like this specific color of brown orange that's kind of like this lighter terracotta color so I just thought this would be a nice addition to my like winter wardrobe and it just goes with my color palette in general as you can see i'm wearing brown so next i got a few things from altered state i find that store very hit or miss it's very like southern girl style which i know it's like a southern clothing store so maybe that's why I definitely prefer the store's collection in the fall and winter time as opposed to summer i feel like their summer stuff is like very like you know that like Christian girl autumn meme? It's like that type of store. Like, I don't know how else to describe it, but I feel like their summer stuff is like kind of preppy and just not really my style. But in the winter, when they have really cute pants and sweaters and dresses and stuff like that, that's when I really like it. So I tend to go in more in the fall and winter, like I said, when I know I'll enjoy it. But I went in there just to see what was going on, hadn't been there in a while, and I found these really cute pants. I love these pants. I think they're so cute. I just love pants like this. I find them so flattering on my body type but they are just these like stretchy band pants and they have they're not band pants but they have a stretchy band that's what I'm trying to say basically just these fitted pants they have a stretchy band they're a little bit on like the mid-rise side i would say they're definitely high-waisted but because of this deeper v cut in the front they kind of like you know they do that thing but anyways they are these flowy pants as you can see they have a bit of a bell at the bottom and they're just these beautiful crushed velvet black pants I love pants like this. I think they're so flattering. Just these like high-waisted fitted pants and then they have a little flare at the bottom. 
Like, I think that's so cute. I love pants like this. They also had these really cute pants at Altered State, which I'm guessing are Scam's Cozy Collection dupes, which I love loungewear. So I picked up these pants. So they have this stretchy band and a drawstring, and then they're just these really pretty like tan oatmeal colored pants and they're just super fuzzy and soft and warm and cozy and how many times can I say those words like I said altered state is like a southern store so I found this this is a really cute little just like soft crew neck and it says Georgia on my mind I thought it was cute again just good for like lounging work from home sleeping whatever just very cozy and lastly I just got some skincare and makeup products I got these actually over Black Friday weekend. These were like the only things I bought for myself over Black Friday and Cyber Monday. Charlotte Tilbury finally, finally came back in stock with the Hollywood Contour Wand. Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Contour Wand and I get it in the shade medium slash deep. So it's just a cream contour. I love this product so much. I use it to cream contour every single time I do my makeup. I'm wearing it right now. I love this product so much. It's just always sold out every time I look. I'm literally on email notification anytime it comes back in stock. I just buy it. And it was like a deal where if you bought two of the Hollywood like cream products, it was actually 10% off. Also decided to get this Spotlight Hollywood Beauty Light Wand. This is the Easy Highlighter. I've actually never tried this before, but apparently it's a really pretty like champagne highlighter. They are really beautiful products. The way they blend out, they just look so skin like i really do love these products so i am excited to try out the highlighter i also picked up some stuff from hero cosmetics they're most well known i would say for their mighty patch those pimple patches that you put on i've actually never even tried those because i don't really get a lot of like active acne like i don't really get like pimples or like zits or anything most of my acne is like whiteheads and blackheads i need like different types of products for those issues i don't really have like pimples that need to be like extracted by like a pimple patch you know so i actually decided to try out some of their body care i got this hero brave body once over toner it's for empowering acne prone skin on the body so it's supposed to purify and revitalize with zinc pca aha and mighty mineral complex and it's supposed to be used daily for bacteria balance it's supposed to minimize excess oil revitalize dull and congested skin and balance skin with silver malachite and copper so basically what you're supposed to do with this is after you're done showering before you put on like any lotion or anything is you're supposed to spray this toner on any problem areas i tend to have some like congestion and like blackheads and stuff like in between my chest so i've been spraying it on there and then also it's really nice because this is like a spray bottle so you can like aim it downwards and i'll use it kind of in between my shoulder blades because i find that sometimes i get some like whiteheads and stuff back there which it's my back like how am i supposed to see or get to any of those so this line is supposed to be really good for body acne so yeah i just got this again i don't really have like active acne i just have like congestion around certain areas of my skin and like does anyone know if you can get a facial for your body that would be really nice actually because i definitely need that i also got the hero brave body deep scrub and it's supposed to be used weekly for resurfacing rough uneven skin it buffs away oily buildup and infuses skin with antioxidants this is the body scrub that you use once a week but you're supposed to use that toner every day they have some other body care products they have like a shower gel and a lotion but i just thought these two products would be good to start just to see if they work i also decided to get this lightning wand because they were having a really good deal on it so this is the hero cosmetics lightning wand it has vitamin c niacinamide and tranexamic acid i think i'm saying that correctly but i love niacinamide it is one of my favorite ingredients in skincare products so i am really excited to try this lightning wand because i do struggle with acne scarring and dark spots basically it is just a rollerball to just roll it over any dark spots i'm not really sure the order in which you do this like do you do this before or after moisturizer obviously right now i do have on makeup so you can't see my acne scars but i do have like a couple right here and then i usually get them on my forehead i definitely will have the occasional dark spots so i just thought it would be nice to try this out i'm always in the market for products like this so that is everything that i have to show you guys in this haul i really hope you guys enjoy this collective winter haul and i hope you guys are enjoying my vlogmas series so far i will link my previous vlogmas videos down below in case you missed them i hope you guys are looking forward to the rest of my vlogmas series thank you all so much for watching make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe bye everyone